Come on, boy. <laughs> Mickey Mouse's clubhouse is just fine. Damn it. Who's touching my damn things? <laughs> Who the hell is touching Mickey Mouse's generators? Why the f is Mickey Mouse such a player hater? Hey, Mickey, your theme parks suck. <laughs> what? Got your nose. It, it, that was the old. That was the old uh, adage there. But the one I prefer the most is like, <laughs> got your nose. Look out, he's got a nose. Bang, 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 bang. <laughs> <laughs> from Asdif movie, the very first bit from Asdif movie ever. Gosh, that may, that makes me feel old. Jesus, oh. Uh, just thinking about the fact that Asdif movie has been out. Uh, they that Tom Scott has been putting those out for so long, and he's still putting them out, which is awesome, by the way. Uh, also, uh, you know it. And also, look, yeah, you know, look at how the internet has changed since then. And now, you know, we have Reddit, we have like, um, you know, people like MK who compile everything together. Uh, you know, or a group like MK compiles everything together and just basically just shows us the sav absolute savagery that the internet can contain. <laughs> and yeah. Um, I'm I'm worried about this first one here because it's Kermit the Frog staring like just like this, just like is Kermit gonna have to slap a bitch? That's <laughs> it's like, uh, but I'm also seeing the comment down below. My school has a Kermit the Frog plushie in the science room, so when we dissect frogs, he watches his siblings get cut open. Oh my god, it's kind of dark. That's super dark, but you know what? I approve because that's actually pretty funny. So, whew. Sorry, everyone. It's been a very, very long day. I, I had a doctor's appointment earlier and they messed up my back. Uh, did I have a chance to tell you about that, Nick? No. Yeah, I told them, I went in for like, I had a, I have a shoulder issue. I've had it for a long time. It's like uh, my shoulder pops right there. Whenever I lift it up this high, it just pops out and I can't really do anything about it. Uh, so I went there and I told them about that and I also told them about my back. Uh, they looked at my shoulder a lot, but then they told me, you know, hey, lay down flat real quick and then uh, uh, we're going to put this uh, thing under your legs and we want you to stretch your legs like down, like pull your ankles away from your body as hard as you can. I'm like, okay. I did it, and then all of a sudden, I felt just like a very sharp pain shoot up my spine. I'm just like, ow! Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Oh, God. No, no. Oh, God. And I rolled off the table, and I and I couldn't stand. I was on all fours. I was just like, hey, what in the heck was that, man? They're like, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. We tweaked your sciatic nerve. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Here, here. Hold on. And then he, uh, they go in there, and they get a steroid shot, and they give me a shot. And I'm just like, oh, God. I came in here to get help, man. <laughs> Y'all put me down for the count. Yeah, what the fuck? Oh. But anyway, that doctor then, uh, you know, he basically just made sure I was okay and everything. He said he was so sorry. He's never seen a reaction to the to that treatment like that. And he's and he he apologizes and he he's not he he didn't charge me for that session. He he said he said if you want to come back, we will not charge you for future sessions for uh, for quite some time on this. We're so sorry. So I'm just like, okay, I guess I'm not gonna go back there for a while. <laughs> Probably never. I don't know. I'm still I'm still stewing it over. Uh, was it a chiropractor? Or was it? Uh, it was a, it was a uh, hell, It was a rehabilitation clinic. Mm. They specialize in treating like athletes and stuff like that. And they told, and, you know, with my shoulder injury, the way it is and, like, how long I've had it, you know, they basically, uh, what they did was they did the chiropractic hammer. They had the little uh, uh, chisel thing. It's like a soft a chisel that they just, like, put in here under this uh, joint. And then they just, like, smacked it quite a few times and it, like, popped a little bit. And it feels a bit better. You know, it doesn't, it, the uh, snap when my shoulder comes down is nowhere near as severe as it was. It's it's better, but they said about a few more treatments of that and I should be good. 
but then the whole back situation happened and i'm just like nah i'm i'm i may not go back i i don't know it's it just that hurt really badly but anyway um so yeah uh cursed comments uh back on back trying to get back on the subject somehow some way uh got your nose uh let's see what uh see what mk has to say my school has a Kermit the Frog plushie in the science room, so when we dissect frogs, he watches his siblings get cut open. Oh. Accurate. This mirror is a little bit loud. What's up, guys, and welcome back to MK. My name is Damien, and today we're looking through r slash cursed comments. When you take a monster crap, but it leaves no trace in the toilet, I am the brown ninja. I wish I could do that. I've got to lick it off. You stand, frozen in place as you see a gigantic clump of grapes. You rub your eyes frantically as you cannot believe what has paid out before you. It begins to turn around. With your mouth ajar, you discover an elderly man with a mic being consumed by the grapes. He mutters the words, Got any grapes? And runs at you. In a life or death moment, you jump up and begin to run as fast as the wind towards the college campus, knowing that if you stop, you too will be consumed by the grapes. Therapist, it's called a Rorschach test. Look at the ink blots and tell me what you see. A butterfly. And this. A butterfly. And this. A butterfly. So, you want to screw butterflies? <laughs> you know, I usually like to dress as a butterfly with huge boobs and just flop around with my butt cheeks clapping in the air while I terrorize the whole town. Oh. Goes to the hospital or nursing room, releases all the babies into the wild. Go, my children. Be free. Ah, uh, should be a good hunt this year. <laughs> And That's always what happens with shows. The fandoms are crap, like Steven Universe, Rick and Morty, the Bible, etc. One time I had a dream that Adam Sandler took over the world and enslaved everyone, and I had to jerk off his nose like a wiener and sticky stuff came out. I woke up and I nutted the bed. What? Petition to make Pornhub Rewind. Oh, it's still on Watch Mojo vids. Top 10 stretchiest urethras. No! Uh, you know, putting uh. mushrooms in the same spot as Frey uh. Maps has never looked so cute. Uh, what the what? fuck? Ugh. Why would you say that? That's what the maps in Nagasaki and Hiroshima look like. Oh. No. Girls, feet, face, hair, body, boys. Towel is towel. My nut towel is old and my bath towel is fluffy. Your username is the name of future fast food restaurant. What meals do they serve? Well, we're actually going out of business. That's because we opened up across the street. What is oh. your favorite food named you? Me. Mom, can I eat you in the bed? Mom. Sure, sweetie, but don't get too messy. <laughs> I won't. Hey, that's a super long mini marshmallow. And knowing that every marshmallow is once part of a flaccid marshmallow tube abomination is hurting my insides. Hey, what moment made you go, huh? Maybe I've delved too far into the porn rabbit hole. Uh, a video of a man putting his head in a vagina. Mama! Mama, I'm coming home! <laughs> Service members of Reddit, what is your worst military wife story? Got back from an 8th month deployment, buddy's wife was 6 months pregnant. FedEx is amazing. Really? That's sad. Oh. Christmas is coming, so if you want this but can't handle this and you're gonna do this, maybe you should buy this instead. Just buy burger if you're hungry. So close oh. to being dead. Don't text and drive! Oh dude, he's alive, but he's not really looking good. Hey dude, how many fingers am I holding up? Shakes bag of fingers in front of driver's face. Come on now, don't be shy! If the driver gets the answers wrong, he gets his fingers headed into the bed. <laughs> that sounds like a crip TV premise. When your mom has the same name as your crush and you accidentally send your crush a wiener pick. There are no mistakes. Master Ugwe. Me, hating waking up in the morning. Me changing my alarm to a song I like. I start to hate the song as a result. <laughs> I use the purge siren as an alarm, and it motivates to get up because I think I get to kill someone. Roust me! Aw, oh, dude. The only thing this guy could engineer is a device that keeps the goat from sliding off his wiener. The last airman had a blue arrow on all of his extremities, so he probably had one on the tip of his wiener, too. That's where he waterbends from. You know, waterbenders could probably bloodbend their own wieners to make themselves rock hard, kind of like Viagra. Neat theory. When the warlock tries to bring the group together, Christian heart, Jewish heart, Muslim heart. I'm not trying to make a point, I'm just showing off my collection. Meme aside, <laughs> why isn't that person wearing gloves? Do you always wear gloves when you eat? <laughs> Ridiculous. Damn it. He's probably thinking about other girls. How do blind people know when to stop wiping their butt? Easy. Taste test. <laughs> For slaves. Oh, 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 no. Ugh. Nasty motherfucker. Oh, you cocksucker. <laughs> Shopping, and I don't want to use code words at checkout. 
The muscle in the tendon. You know, I cracked my brother's neck and I'm wondering why he's still sleeping. Let me, uh, bust on him thighs. I'm an amputee. Let me, uh, bust on him stumps. Yo, you got some sexy looking stumps. <laughs> Fact. You eat 28 spiders in your lifetime. Always 28. If you're about to die and you've only eaten three, then... <laughs> <laughs> then 25 spiders arrive at once. <laughs> you have anti-periods. At a certain time of the month, your body will feel much better and healthier than normal. And you'll have all of your emotions under control. And blood rushes into your vagina, you know? I can't think of a more disturbing coaster set. Oh. <laughs> I did this in my morning wood. Getting a squirrel stuck in his rectum. Pathetic. I almost had a dog in my butt. <laughs> I almost had a croc eat me out. You guys are weak. My wife crashed my Mustang! Oh no, is she hurt? Oh, not yet, she locked herself in the bathroom! Hey, come on now. I get it's a urinal, but I don't trust it. <laughs> no, I don't either. What the hell? No. 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 No! I'd happily sit inside one of those and chop off anything that peeks in. No! Ah! <laughs> Definitely no. What the absolute oh, shit? Return to D-Day. Oh man, I feel bad for him. I must miss his friends. Oh no, worry, he'll be joining them soon. That could be taken as a positive, like a little like that could be turned into like something that's cute though. No, I screwed a girl with one leg. I should have used my wiener. My daughter found snow in my socks! <laughs> yep, snow. No, that's dried nut crumbles. Put it on your salad. Blech. Your task is to blow a job interview in the first 30 seconds. What do you do? <clears throat> okay, so uh, how should you do a sexual harassment policy? <laughs> <laughs> Before the first 30 seconds. Before we begin, I'm required by law to inform you that I'm a sexual predator. Active or retired? No, in training. Uh, oh. When you go on 100 in a school zone and the speed bump starts screaming. Again? <laughs> I'm so popular, I have five girls chasing me right now. Should probably give them their money back. Take their internal organs too next time. That should help with the chasing problem. Laughs in Chinese prisoners. Oh. 1950s. I bet in the future we'll have flying cars. 2019. I've been microwaving my underwear to warm them up for nearly three years and now I think I have testicular cancer. Well, you should have taken them off first. After my mom <laughs> passed away. We told my little sister if she sees a butterfly, it's my mom. We went on our first family vacation since my mom passed, and today I heard my sister talking to Butterfly and saying, I'm so happy you could have made it, Mama. I knew you wouldn't miss it. My heart. Oh. Man, she saw that butterfly get eaten. That's sad. Kermit the Frog paying tribute after Jim Henson's death in 1991. Now someone else's hands in your butt, Kermit. So sorry. Best airplane marriage proposal. Engine failure. Will you marry me? <laughs> no. I was an airs mountain. Oh, it's an owl burrito! Oh, look at it! Instantly puts a smile on his face. And honestly, it's my favorite meat choice in a burrito, too. Every female porn star is a cannibal considering they swallow sperm. And so are gay men and anyone who eats at my restaurant. Oh. <laughs> no, not the one! <laughs> Nasty motherfucker. <laughs> He's not serious. <laughs> I bet he is. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna level with y'all. This was. I mean, he could be saying something gross, or he could be saying something sinister. Like, uh, uh, I mean, from context, you're assuming he means he jizzes in the food, but he could just be straight up saying he kills people and puts human meat in the food at his restaurants. So. Well, okay, here's a, I have a confession to make. Uh, I don't know if I want to hear this. No, this isn't for me. This is this happened while I was working at a uh, at a friggin' uh, Hardee's. Um, had a worker back there uh, in the back. He made uh, he, he basically like ran the refrigerator area and all that. You know, like food prep and all that. Sliced up tomatoes, catch or you know, got the ketchup bottles. Lettuce, all that. Yeah, he, he was basically like our food prep guy. I walk in on him uh, getting blown by his girlfriend in the back there. And I'm like, oh, Jesus, Tony, what the fuck, man? <laughs> oh, Jesus. And he's just like, he's like, five minutes, bro. Five minutes. And I'm like, 
what the fuck ever. All of a sudden, I, I'm, I'm sitting there, like I'm wait, I'm just like, I see her walk up and walk out the back door, no pun intended, uh, and then uh, all of a sudden Tony walks up and he's carrying this uh, prep tra- or prep box, you know, little one, you know, those little boxes that you can like have the lid on and everything. He carries it up to the front and it's full of tomatoes, and uh, he then opens the thing up and dumps it in just dumps it in the 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 garbage and i'm like hey what'd you throw the tomatoes away for man we're low up here and he's like i gotta go cut you a fresh one i'm like what happened to oh no (laughs) at least he threw them away i'm like i'm like i don't want to know any details all i need to know is how long until you can get me some more tomatoes up here? Cause, dude, I'm running low. And he's like, he's like, yeah, yeah, give me a couple minutes. He goes back there, he comes back with a fresh thing, and I'm and I'm like scanning over these things. I'm like, okay, we're good, thanks. Jesus, he got fired about a, a month later. Uh, turns out it wasn't I wasn't the only one who caught him getting getting top back there behind you know behind the refrigerator. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, fast food, and it's it's freaking disgusting. Last one, Blurst News. Six-year-old with one arm takes on PGA Tour pros and loses. Well, on the other hand, oh wait, he doesn't have an other hand. A woman in Florida claimed her current fiance was abusing her. Here's the recording which shows she beats herself and hysterically screams. You know, not much of a tantrum. She didn't even run into the closet, shook to her underwear, and tried to shove her remote up her bum. People don't even try anymore. Whoa! Name a good movie okay, that was ruined that by reference. a bad date. And yes, fully expecting to hear all the details. Uh, I was watching Into the Spider-Verse, and it was in a drive-in, and I couldn't hear the movie because she wouldn't stop asking me to let her out of the trunk. Can't even watch it the same anymore. San Francisco has an app where people can geotag locations of human feces for cleanup. <laughs> Bro, imagine taking it. <coughs> if that's real... Jesus wept. And from what I've heard from my friend Jesse, yeah, that's real. Who the hell is that? That's Sam that's San Francisco, bro. Uh, of course. Uh and here's the kicker. It's not just San Francisco. Uh it's also Portland and certain parts of Seattle. Jesus wept. What is wrong? Like, uh, okay. Human feces for cleanup. <laughs> Bro, imagine taking an emergency poop and a big red text on your phone says, You've been spotted. Every time you're at a funeral, your wiener grows an inch. Oh, imagine being a priest, well endowed by the power of God. No matter what you use to wipe your bum, it feels soft and always gets the job done in one pass. Imagine being so good that every time you wipe your butt, you automatically know without even jerking off. Hey, what kind of loser jerks off to anime girls? Hmm. Why are you looking at me? I'm not doing it. At least not right now. Overwatch 2. Can't wait for the mission where you had to suppress protesters in Hong Kong. (laughs) Attention pro Americana, you have been banned from, from Overwatch forums. You should hold her. Shoulder or so or sold. Shoulder, 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 shoulder. Nah, it's you should have sold her. Hey, y'all have any first day horror stories? Talk to me. Oh, you know, I met this dude at his house to be taken to the date, and a whole shit all happened in front of us, and one of the shooters ran by us, and we knew him, and he said, Oh, y'all dating, that's cute, and kept shooting. (laughs) (laughs) Jesus Christ. That's a real G right there, man. Oh, no. Oh, making my dookie twinkle. Glitter pills to make their poop sparkle. And Thomas had never seen such shiny crap before. Dude, imagine doing anal and you take your wiener out and it's covered in colored sparkles. No! I like that. Animal rights win. KFC has now announced that they will serve their chickens alive. Uh, just till I like them. Able to fight back. (laughs) Unzips. Classic. Call me old fashioned, but I believe dance is the only true language. Oh, call me ancient, 
But I believe ritual sacrifice is the only true means of self-expression. Who is Damn. that? Is that Chewbacca? It looks like Chewbacca screwed the Grinch. And they're terrified it does. of him. Cursed swing. Oh, I just lost. No, no, November. SMH. Tesla has to cut down forest to build Gigafactory 4. We'll plant three times as many trees. Everyone like that. That's what kings did. Killed every single person related to the prior rule and impregnated 700 slaves, and yet they're regarded as evil? Pfft, whatever. What does it mean if one's ejaculate is roughly the consistency of cottage cheese? It means she might have to chew. You're welcome. It's gross. <laughs> oh, come on, bro. <laughs> I don't mind getting my hands dirty. Girlfriend, I can't. I'm on my period. My wiener, this way. No. no. <laughs> hey, what's the point in having a sword if you don't want it getting bloody, huh? Just ask. Annabelle is 25. Me, Netflix and chill. You, sure. Later that night. So, you don't have Netflix. Me, pulls out 20 condoms. I don't have chill either. Plot twist. She has 20 wieners. I mean, hey, she has no chill. <laughs> Woman got a new magnetic nose because of autoimmune disease. What? That's so weird, bro. That's cr Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> got your no- Oh my god, okay. All right, no, we'll- There we'll it just, is. We'll just put that back on. The man who hasn't bathed in 65 years. Man, I really hope he's circumcised, because imagine all that cheese. Oh, just all that cheese. This is a cat. He looks down on the tweet below him. It is stupid. Not gonna lie, I would eat Baby Yoda. I mean, hey, that is a stupid tweet, Baby Yoda. Yeah, that is a stupid tweet. Damn it, PewDiePie. Yoda's a gem, Felix. A gem. How dare you. Hey, Baby Yoda implies the existence of Yoda's sex. Okay, maybe you're having second thoughts about Baby Yoda. I don't know how I feel about this, Abby. More specifically, Baby Yoda implies the existence of adult Yoda's raw dog in it. I hope this helps with how you're feeling about it. Nah, it doesn't actually. It doesn't help at all. When you're browsing the dark web and find an assassination livestream of yourself? Interesting. And that's a whole new meaning to stream sniping. Gamers, am I right? <laughs> it's 2.30 a.m. Wait, it's 2.30- I was gonna say... I was going to when say... When you the dark web and find an assassination livestream of yourself? Well, Interesting. Uh, what's her name? Uh, Suey Park. Uh, Suey Park, how she sees herself on the internet. Like, sorry, but that woman's a bona fide liar. She's been proven to be a liar multiple times. And that's a whole new game for me. And I'm in the men's bathroom. And someone was in another stall and I started blaring the Thomas the Tank Engine theme. And I literally heard them stop peeing out of fear. How do you know it was fear, not arousal? I can see their legs shake. And that's gonna do it for r slash cursed Aww. comments. If you guys liked the video, leave a like down below and subscribe for more content from MK. And if you want to catch more of Damien Lee, you can find me at twitch.tv forward slash Damien Lee live. And as always, I'll be seeing ya. Damn. Some of those are pretty friggin' haggard, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Uh not entirely sure that I enjoyed that experience. <laughs> got a pretty good laugh out of a few of them. And got some like <clears throat> out of others, you know? Just could have done without hearing some of that in my lifetime. I could have as well, but it's not cursed comments for no reason. Jesus. So yeah, this uh, this this MK video was was pretty good. Is not my favorite, but still pretty damn good. That was that was most definitely cursed. Uh, all right. Well, we need to move on. Uh, it's getting late for Nick, and uh, I got to do a little bit more editing before uh, before it gets too late. So yeah, that's uh, yeah, that's it. So until next time, everyone. Signing off. I'm Nate. We'll see you. Mm, everybody, peace out.